as soon as it gets a little bit harder, it, it starts to really appeal to me. But I like that it has these little... <laughs> That's what she said. <laughs> Hi, guys. This is Play It Again. I'm Ginger. And I am Mike. And the homepage threw up a brand new song that I didn't even know was coming. Here. <laughs> Just like that. I spent a lot of time not even knowing who Breaking Benjamin was, and then we had some workers here working on building our gate, and I gave them the Bluetooth speaker and said, play whatever you want while you're working, because I, for one, appreciate being able to play music while you work. Mm -hmm. And he put on this band, and I was like, who is that? In Span Spanish, of course, because we live in Costa Rica, and he only spoke Spanish. And he said it was Breaking Benjamin. And ever since then, I've been a fan. I want to know why everybody's being so mean to Benjamin. That's how he grows. Oh, I see. Right? I guess so. That's why I'm I so I mean, that's fake. what works for me. Anyway, <laughs> so this one's called Awaken. All right. And I'm excited because it's very rare for me to actually catch this band with something new. It's usually <laughs> whatever I've heard is 10 years old already. Well, let's awaken you. <laughs> Wake up, Jeff!
don't think anybody's going to be surprised to hear that my favorite parts were those uh, grungy, head bangy parts. <laughs> no, nobody's surprised by that. Uh, so, so they're very much to my ear, like the like a three-way love child of Evanescence uh, and uh, oh. Lincoln Park. No, no, who's oh, that's where who's I was the, going. Who is uh, Chloe's favorite band? Oh, um, from, from back in the day. Marianas Trench. Marianas Trench. Oh, so no. Marianas Trench, Marianas really? Trench in the chorus, uh, and then like, like, Ginger. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I did say it was bizarre. Those are some chops. Right? My yeah, goodness. That, that is quite the diverse array of influences. <laughs> It's obvious to probably anybody listening right now that this isn't really your genre of music. <laughs> That's all right. No, but I mean, the, my first impression was was very much like these guys are are working in the same kind of field that, that uh, Evanescence pioneered. You know what I mean? Yeah, it's it's uh, anthemic '90s. Yeah. Really yeah. is is kind of I don't know. That's not the name of the genre, but I don't know what the actual but, but, name of the genre would be. But it's what it is. Be, but that's what it always felt like to me was anthemic '90s, which yeah, was yeah. totally my era, and and totally my style of music. Right? Like I really love the the grungy dark parts mm -hmm. quite a bit. As soon as it gets a little bit harder, it, it starts to really appeal to me. <laughs> but I like that it has these little. That's what she said. <laughs> That's why I keep you around, baby. It's, it's not for your dad jokes. <laughs> it's not for the dad jokes. That's just an extra bonus. <laughs> so anyway, actually, that was very much in keeeping with their sound, which is good. I, I mean, I love their sound. Mm -hmm. um, so it fits right in the catalog for me. But I, I like it because it shakes it up a little bit, right? It has that those kind of light, airy parts, and then it gets into that grungy, dirty crunchy guitar sound that I friggin' love. Grungy and dirty and crunchy. That's Ginger's It's totally my right speed. There. It's totally yeah. my speed. So, yeah, once again, I still love this band. Excellent. So I don't know about you, but I will be playing it again. <laughs>